how the bass on this game's audio is really loud for some reason. Uh, greetings YouTube, this is the Sexy Brutal. And if you don't know what that is, it's not what you're thinking. It's the name of the mansion slash casino in the game. And it's kind of like a murder mystery. But you've got to stop the servants from killing the guests. I think that's the goal. But the mansion is on a time loop. So every time they kill a guest, you go back in time and get to stop them. I've heard it's good. It's a puzzle game. Let's do this. Alright. So now... I appear to have uh, full control. I've just been through a tutorial. I don't think I'll bother recording that. Okay, so I've got a limited amount of time to do something about saving the guy. It's on card sharping. Okay. Oop. All right. Okay. Is that a bullet on the ground? Interesting. Let's go have a look at the bullet. Ah, blank cartridge. Uh, how do I... Right. I was wondering how I did that. Uh oh. Oh, I have to... I have to get out of the room, do I? Damn. He's going to take the gun and I'm not going to be able to swap... I was too slow. I need to swap out... I need to put the bullet in the gun. The blank. In the gun. Okay. I'll restart it because I can do that. And I've just lost the bullet cart the blank cartridge, okay. And there's nowhere to actually hide in this room, so I'm gonna Right, I'm gonna have to wait until the guy opens the safe. Get the bullet and put it in the gun. Or put the blank in the gun, should I say. Throw the blank cartridge on the floor. There it is. Now leave. There we go. Now I can get into the room. Pick up the cartridge. <laughs> Not going to work this time. No, you don't. <laughs> oh, was there another bullet in there? Oh! <laughs> Nice shot. Let's have a look around now. Okay. If 
That must be the casino entrance. Goodbye, creepy girl. Alright. Clay Rockridge and Trinity Carrington. Bearing in mind that I have no idea what I'm doing now. Someone in the room. Yep. Someone is there. I don't know where anybody is, so I'm sort of floundering around. Although I have found something. The Four of Diamonds. Interesting. Must be significant somehow. All right, and I've just noticed on the stopwatch, I think those icons are when they're due to die. Fair enough. Where am I? This place, this section is... It's not that big when you're looking on the map, but there's a surprising amount of... There's a surprising amount of space to explore. I think those two are about to die, uh, if they haven't just died, actually. This place just seems to keep on going. I'm pretty sure it, it doesn't. Ah, have I found one of the... The camera feed is now being shown on the main casino screen. Interesting. I'm about to run out of time anyway. One way mirror, yeah. Ah! It's the key code for the CCTV panels, and I got it just in time. And now we go again. Alright, so let's try the CCTV security code now that we know it. Where am I going? Okay, I don't know how he's going to die though. Wait a minute, I've just realised... I've just realised how he dies. That bottler, one of the glasses, is red. I'm guessing he's poisoned him. Or he's going to poison him. Or is that just both of them? Have I done it in one move? Was that was that all I had to do? Ah. Oh. Okay, I thought I had to do something in two different places, but I accidentally did it. And back goes the clock. And here we go again. Holding R2, does that mean I can now hear what he's saying? There we go. Got it. <laughs> and then we go. I still don't know why I'm collecting playing cards, but... Oh, damn, came back out, and out we go, yeah, I'm gonna, I've got no choice but to retreat. Well, the place is definitely getting bigger, it's a bit harder to keep track of everything as well. I mean, time is ticking along, but I don't really know where I'm going. Ah, the guest rooms. This is where I was supposed to be going, I believe. Oh, what happened? Ah, right, it's because I'm in the next area for the, uh, for the rescue. Oh, right. 
She died at seven o'clock. And she has been hung from the bell. How charming. What's this bone key? Okay, let's use the pocket watch. Oh no, I can't. I need the winding key to activate it first. Damn. Damn. It's put me back in the central room again. I really need the winding key for that clock upstairs so it doesn't send me all the way back every single time because now I'm there and I need to get to there to go upstairs to get to where I actually have to be. Okay, now what? Oh, I found the winding key. Here we go, right. Let's use the winding key. Here we go. Okay. Right, I think that did it. Yeah. I'm now synchronized to that clock, so now this clock will be my restart point. Yes, this is more like it, right. Oh wow, I didn't realise I could do that. I could press left and right to to change what time it is. Ah, so I don't know where she was at that time. But I know where she was then. I see. Right. That's clever. If you track someone through each loop, you'll eventually be able to see where everyone was. My goodness, I can hear her whispering. Ah, there's a secret passage. <laughs> I didn't know about that a moment ago. Oh, I've got a new piece of information. A oh, hidden package. A uh, hidden package. Really? That's what you thought it said? Hidden passage is what it actually says. Oh boy. No wonder I'm going around in circles, eh? I wonder, can I stay in the same room as her if I'm up top? Does that count as being in the same room? And that's what you're supposed to do. Right. That felt like a surprising amount of faffing around for what was effectively a, a simple fix at the end of the day. Oh. Ow! Ah! My leg's gone to sleep. Very painful. Ow. Anyway, um, I've saved uh, four guests three groups of guests because two of them came together. I've got three of what appears to be six masks. Wow, and there's a whole deck of playing cards to find. I've already got nine of 52. Well, it's fascinating so far. Um, the main challenge seems to be working out how to go about saving everybody. The actual act of saving them is relatively easy once you know how. But that's the trick. You got to... The easiest way to do it seems to be to follow the guest around so that you know how they die and then backtrack from there. I quite like this. Although I'm into my puzzle games anyway, so... I tend to like this kind of thing. And this is something very different from your average puzzle game. Not complex, but I like it. I can see why it got such good reviews. Okay. I'm going to keep playing this, see if I can actually finish this one. See you next time.